Uh, thanks for that legend thing. Yeah, I already uh, gave an autogram today. This is, uh, I mean, it feels really, I mean, you, I, mean I love you for that, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> so, but now I want to sort of maybe uh, more than trying to show off how cool we are trying to inspire you, and I hope I manage to do that. And um, I want to do that live, on stage, from my phone. Now, the problem is that this cable here it's going way back up there, and I had terrible crashes when this cable is very long. So um, let's hope it doesn't crash because there is no plan B. Yeah, there's no net, no thing for me. So when that happens, I'm fucked, yeah. But so it's all about mobile music, and I want to play you some mobile music. So for the sound engineer up there, don't worry if you get any feedback, I'll handle it. Um, so the first thing that I want to show you is um, a track that was published um, by an artist called Jimmy Edgar. I think he's actually in Berlin as well. He was publishing on K7 and I think even on Warp. I don't know where, but he's, he's doing really cool stuff and he published this track in, um, I think, 2010 or 11. And... Um, and he came to us and, and, you know, said, hey, can we do something with this? And I said, sure. And so this is how mobile music sounds to me. So it's music, right? This is how his track sounds like. You know, this is how I think this track should sound like on a mobile. you got it. <laughs> this, could, this could, of course, go on forever, but I'm not as, um, as good as a performer as Jimmy Edgar is. That's why I want to stop this right here. But um, I think this is really mobile music, right? It is actually using everything that's on this device. And I think that's the big difference. If you look back to what, you know, recorded music or music used to be, uh, basically it came from the Walkman, or the Walkman was sort of this big thing at that time. Now this is the Walkman of the 21st century, but compared to our good old Walkman, this thing can do much more. And I think it's a question of how does do uh, creatives and, and musicians make use of this technology. And that's basically what we're trying to do at RJDJ. We want to give a platform, we want to explore these new formats, we want to make exciting new stuff. Do you have a question? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so you can, you can record this and um, you... Pardon? Yeah, directly when I do it. Then I can send it to you. Create the laugh song or I don't know, whatever. I feel like, or you feel, uh, whatever. So uh, <laughs> you can record it. Um, yeah, I think basically we can think this whole idea of music in a totally different way, but of course recording something and sharing something that is also a track and you can, you know, I guess, see all uh, sorts of technical, um, of, of legal implications there. Um, but yeah, in general, you can do that. Um, so. Um, now you totally got me out of my thing, yeah, but anyways. Um, but now let's look where we are at the moment with mobile music. And I think uh, we heard a lot about mobile music before from Spotify and so on. So the main mobile music thing for me right now is this app called Music on my device, yeah, right there. So when I start this thing, I get a whole list of songs. It's huge. I mean, I don't even have such a big, you know, collection on there. There's people who have much more stuff. So this is mobile music right now. And I think this sucks. 
Yeah, but yeah, I mean, this is music, right? So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show you something that we're doing, which I think is, is kind of um, solving this problem, at least a bit. And the app is called Music Zones. And we're testing it currently in the UK market. And basically, when you start Music Zones, it is scanning your environment. It is checking out where you are, what you do. Actually, I should be online as well, but I'm not, it doesn't matter. And then it comes up and says, I'm away. Yeah, I'm not at home. I'm from Austria. This is definitely not Austria. And um, also, it's a work day, as you can see on the left. And it's loud in here. And from all these situations I'm in at the moment, the away thing is the biggest thing. I'm away from home. And it plays me music that fits for that situation. Yeah. Now I can say, OK, Pomrad isn't really a cool away track. So I just say it's a fail here. And here comes um, Kelly's. Yeah, this is an away track. Yeah, this is what I'm listening to <laughs> when I'm away from home. Yeah, yeah. So what's happening here in the background is that the app actually learns your music taste, your profile, your music profile of stuff that you're listening to when you're not the home, when you're not um, at home, or when you're in a specific situation. So here is my away. Here's my away charts currently, yeah. And um, now, of course, there's a lot more situations. This is actually not the way music. Um, so we have a lot more situations, like when you're active, uh, when you're calm, when it's dinner, when it's Friday, when it's full moon, uh, when it's loud, when it's morning, it's night, when it's raining, when you sleep, when there's snow, uh, I don't know. Like we have situations for basically everything. And the cool stuff is that the app is automatically detecting um, what you're doing. So let's say currently I'm away, listening to this away stuff, but then I start to walk. So you can see now it detects I'm walking. And it is switching into the active situation. And it plays me my favorite active music, which is Rammstein. Yes. <laughs> Actually, I was expecting more hardcore metal stuff will come soon. Anyway, so this is the music I'm listening to when I'm running. And the app is automatically detecting that and creating a mix for that. Yeah. So I think. This is much more of a mobile music experience than what we see in the music player currently. But what I showed you right at the start, my little dance thing, where music actually was a very reactive thing. And you think of this here now. So this is just playing, you know, existing music, recorded music. But what if this thing now can play reactive music, like for example, when I walk? And for that, I want to show you my last example, which is a track we have done for, for um, jogging. So here it is. So right when you start this thing, let me just turn this down. Start. It just plays some uh, relaxing chords. Um, you know, easy going, you prepare your job, you're still at home, then you get outside and you start to walk. And then you start to run. And then there's a traffic light, it's red, you stop. Bus is passing, cars are passing. Green light, you go again. So, yeah, that's it. So I think, um, you know, these devices, they open the world to a whole new way of thinking music, of producing music, distributing music, and consuming music. And by just playing good old songs on these devices, that's going to be a fraction of what we are seeing in the future, of new stuff that's coming up here 
And, um, and yeah, when that's happening, RJDJ is there and happy to be the format for that. We are currently um, doing apps um, like Inception, the app, or the Dark Knight Rises Set Plus app, which is using soundtracks from those movies and augmenting them. And they are um, very, very crazy experiences that I think you should all uh, maybe listen to at some point and download these things because uh, they are including your whole environment in sort of this soundtrack experience. And um, these apps are doing really, really well. Um, like in Inception alone, we had in the first week when we launched one million downloads. And, and you know, that's actually quite a good strategy because, of course, everyone knows these movies. And, uh, and everyone um, actually also loves, or many people love these soundtracks, and they get those soundtrack experience in a whole new way. And it was interesting, someone was mentioning the soundtrack of your life. What was that? We'll be over there, because that's funny. We always said it's the soundtrack of your life. <laughs> because, you know, it's customizing music to what you do, to what situation you are in. And it, 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 yeah, it makes a soundtrack for your life. That's it from my side.